Your liver is a hard-working organ, tirelessly filtering toxins, aiding digestion, and storing energy. But did you know that certain foods may damage this vital organ? From sugary snacks to processed foods, what you eat may either support your liver's health or lead to serious conditions. Chronic liver disease, hepatitis, and even liver failure are some of the diseases often caused indirectly by our diet. Understanding which foods to avoid is crucial for maintaining a healthy liver and overall well-being. In this video, we'll explore 10 foods that may destroy your liver if consumed in excess. We'll explain how these foods affect your liver, which elements in your body they impact, and why it's important to limit or avoid them. But it doesn't mean that all foods are deadly to your liver. Stay tuned till the end to find out the list of liver-healthy foods. 1. Alcohol Alcohol itself is a toxin. When the liver metabolizes alcohol, it converts it into acetaldehyde, a highly toxic and reactive substance. Acetaldehyde may damage liver cells, leading to inflammation and scarring. This damage may disrupt the normal functioning of the liver, impairing its ability to process nutrients and filter toxins. Moreover, the metabolism of alcohol in the liver generates reactive oxygen species, which are harmful molecules that cause oxidative stress. Oxidative stress occurs when there is an imbalance between the production of reactive oxygen species and the liver's ability to detoxify them. This stress may damage liver cells, proteins, and DNA, leading to inflammation and cell death. Over time, this may cause significant liver injury, contributing to conditions such as alcoholic hepatitis and cirrhosis. Additionally, excessive alcohol consumption may disrupt the liver's ability to metabolize fats properly. This may lead to a condition known as fatty liver disease, where fat accumulates in liver cells. Fatty liver is an early stage of alcohol-related liver disease and may progress to more severe conditions like alcoholic hepatitis. As fat continues to build up, it causes further inflammation and scurrying, impairing the liver's function even more. In fact, experts suggest that drinking as little as 20 grams of alcohol for women and 30 grams for men may worsen liver damage. 2. Sugary foods and drinks. When you consume sugary foods and beverages, they often contain large amounts of fructose, glucose, and sucrose. Fructose is metabolized primarily in the liver. The liver transforms fructose into fat, unlike glucose, which is processed by many cells in the body. This process may lead to an accumulation of fat within liver cells, known as non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Over time, this buildup of fat may cause inflammation and liver cell damage, and potentially lead to more severe liver conditions like non-alcoholic steatohepatitis, fibrosis, and cirrhosis. Furthermore, a high intake of sugary foods and drinks may lead to insulin resistance. Insulin is a hormone that helps regulate blood sugar levels. When you consume too much sugar, your body may become less responsive to insulin, forcing the pancreas to produce more of it. This insulin resistance causes higher levels of insulin and glucose in the bloodstream, which may further promote fat accumulation in the liver. This condition exacerbates non-alcoholic fatty liver disease and increases the risk of liver inflammation and damage. According to research, higher fructose intake increases the chance of developing non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. 3. Processed foods and trans fats Processed foods are a major component of many processed snacks, fast foods, and baked goods. These often contain trans fats, which are created through a process called hydrogenation to extend the shelf life of food products. However, trans fats are difficult for the liver to break down and process. Consuming trans fats may lead to fat buildup in the liver, contributing to non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. This condition may progress to more severe liver damage. In addition to that, processed foods often contain a variety of artificial additives, such as preservatives, flavor enhancers, and colorings. These chemicals may place a significant burden on the liver, which is responsible for detoxifying and eliminating them from the body. Continuous exposure to these additives may lead to liver inflammation, impairing the liver's ability to function properly. 4. Fried foods Fried foods are often high in unhealthy fats, particularly trans fats and saturated fats. The excessive intake of these fats overwhelms the liver's capacity to metabolize them efficiently, resulting in fat buildup. This fat accumulation may cause liver inflammation and scarring, further impairing liver function and increasing the risk of more severe liver conditions. Moreover, the process of frying food at high temperatures 
leads to the formation of harmful compounds such as advanced glycation end products, ages, and acrylamide. Ages are formed when proteins or fats combine with sugar during cooking and may cause oxidative stress and inflammation in the liver. Additionally, acrylamide forms in certain foods when they are cooked at high temperatures. It is also harmful and may contribute to liver toxicity. These compounds may damage liver cells, leading to inflammation and impairing the liver's ability to detoxify and perform its essential functions. Additionally, fried foods are typically high in calories, which may contribute to obesity and metabolic syndrome. Both of these conditions are major risk factors for developing non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Excess body weight and metabolic imbalances put additional strain on the liver, leading to fat accumulation and inflammation. As the liver struggles to cope with these excess calories and the associated fat, its ability to function properly is further compromised, increasing the risk of liver disease. According to a study with 74 overweight patients, 41% of patients with hepatic stetosis consumed more fried foods than those without the disease. 5. High Sodium Foods Consuming high levels of sodium may lead to elevated blood pressure, a condition known as hypertension. High blood pressure increases the workload on the liver as it tries to manage the increased blood flow. Over time, this added stress may lead to damage in the liver's blood vessels, impairing its ability to filter toxins and process nutrients effectively. Apart from that, high sodium intake causes the body to retain more water, leading to increased blood volume. This water retention puts additional strain on the liver and may cause swelling and inflammation. The liver becomes less efficient at filtering blood and metabolizing nutrients, which may exacerbate existing liver conditions or contribute to the development of new ones. Additionally, high sodium levels may induce cellular stress in the liver. Sodium may disrupt the balance of electrolytes within liver cells, leading to cellular dysfunction. This imbalance may trigger oxidative stress, a condition where harmful molecules known as reactive oxygen species accumulate and damage cells, proteins, and DNA. Oxidative stress is a key factor in liver inflammation and damage, contributing to conditions like non-alcoholic fatty liver disease and liver fibrosis. According to a study, consuming over 9 to 12 grams of salt per day was linked to a higher risk of non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. 6. Red meat. Red meat is rich in saturated fats, which are difficult for the liver to process. When you consume large amounts of saturated fats, they accumulate in the liver, leading to non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. This condition occurs when fat builds up in liver cells, causing inflammation and liver cell damage. Over time, continuous intake of saturated fats may exacerbate this fat accumulation. The liver struggles to metabolize these fats efficiently, resulting in oxidative stress and further liver damage. Moreover, red meat contains high levels of cholesterol, which may also contribute to liver damage. Excessive dietary cholesterol may lead to the formation of cholesterol deposits within the liver. These deposits may cause inflammation and impair the liver's ability to function properly. High cholesterol levels in the blood may also lead to the development of gallstones, which can obstruct bile flow and cause additional stress and damage to the liver. The liver's attempts to process and eliminate this excess cholesterol may further exacerbate liver inflammation and scarring. 7. White bread and rice. White bread and rice have a high glycemic index, meaning they may cause rapid spikes in blood sugar levels after consumption. When you eat foods with a high glycemic index, your body quickly breaks them down into glucose, leading to a sudden increase in blood sugar. This spike prompts the pancreas to release large amounts of insulin to help cells absorb the glucose. Over time, these repeated spikes in blood sugar and insulin may overwhelm the liver's ability to regulate glucose levels, leading to fat accumulation in liver cells. This condition, known as non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, results from the liver converting excess glucose into fat, causing inflammation and liver damage. 8. Artificial sweeteners Artificial sweeteners may disrupt gut health, which indirectly affects liver function. Sweeteners like aspartame, saccharin, and sucrose may alter the balance of beneficial bacteria in the gut. This disruption can lead to a condition known as dysbiosis, where harmful bacteria outnumber beneficial ones. Dysbiosis may increase intestinal permeability, commonly referred to as leaky gut. When the gut barrier is compromised, harmful substances like endotoxins may pass into the bloodstream and reach the liver. 
The liver then works harder to detoxify these substances, leading to inflammation and oxidative stress, which may damage liver cells and impair liver function. 9. High-Fat Dairy Products High-fat dairy foods may contain large amounts of saturated fats, which are difficult for the liver to process. When you consume saturated fats, they accumulate in liver cells, leading to non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. This condition occurs when excess fat builds up in the liver, causing inflammation and damage to liver cells. Over time, continuous intake of saturated fats may exacerbate fat accumulation, potentially progressing to more severe liver conditions such as non-alcoholic state of hepatitis, fibrosis, and cirrhosis. Apart from that, high-fat dairy products are rich in cholesterol. Excessive dietary cholesterol may lead to the formation of cholesterol deposits within the liver, causing inflammation and impaired liver function. High levels of cholesterol in the blood may also contribute to the development of gallstones, which may obstruct bile flow and place additional stress on the liver. 10. Carbonated Beverages Carbonated beverages, especially sugary sodas, contain high amounts of fructose and other sugars. When you consume these drinks, the liver metabolizes the fructose, converting it into fat. This process may lead to the accumulation of fat within liver cells, a condition known as non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. The liver's struggle to process these excess sugars results in oxidative stress and further liver damage. Thank you for watching. We've covered some crucial information about foods and drinks that can impact liver health, from sugary snacks and processed foods to high-fat dairy products and carbonated beverages. Remember, making informed choices about what you eat can significantly affect your liver's ability to function properly and maintain overall well-being. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more health tips and insights. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. We'd love to hear from you. Share your thoughts or any questions you might have about liver health in the comments below. Stay tuned for more content on how to support your liver and live a healthier life. Take care and see you in the next video.